Ever wondered if the home of Star Trek's Dr. Spock actually exists in our universe? In the intricate tapestry of the cosmos, a fascinating thread was woven in 2018. Scientists reported the discovery of a planet eerily reminiscent of Vulcan, the fictional homeworld of Dr. Spock. This intriguing celestial body orbits the real star 40 Eridani A, the very same star that, according to Star Trek lore, hosts Spock's home planet. This planet was christened HD 26965b, a name that while lacking the poetic charm of Vulcan, holds its own intrigue in the annals of astronomy. Yet, as often happens in the vastness of space, certainty can quickly give way to doubt. The existence of HD 26965b, our potential Vulcan, has recently been called into question. This uncertainty stems from an unusual phenomenon observed in the light signature of its host star, 40 Eridani A. Stars, much like the planets that orbit them, are not static. They're dynamic living entities that undergo changes and exhibit behaviors. In the case of 40 Eridani A, scientists have noted subtle wobbles in the star's light signature. Originally, these wobbles were believed to be the gravitational influence of HD 26965b tugging at its star. But further observations suggest a different story. These wobbles might not be the secret Morse code of a hidden planet, but rather the fiery tantrums of the star itself. Regular eruptions on the surface of 40 Eridani A could be the true culprits behind this cosmic conundrum. The light we see wobbling might simply be the star flexing its stellar muscles, casting doubt on the existence of our Vulcan doppelganger. The universe, it seems, enjoys its share of mysteries, and the existence of HD 26965b, our Vulcan stand-in, certainly joins the ranks. Is it a case of life imitating art, with a real Vulcan hiding in the depths of space? Or is it a cosmic illusion, a trick of light and gravity? The answers are out there, waiting in the stars. So, the reality of our very own Vulcan planet remains a tantalizing mystery. Just 40 light years away, Gliese 12b teases us with the possibility of a new home. Nestled in the far reaches of the cosmos, this exoplanet is not just another celestial body, but a beacon of hope for potential life beyond our world. Gliese 12b, a planet roughly the size of our sister Venus, enjoys an enviable position in the Goldilocks zone of its host star. This is a sweet spot in any planetary system where conditions are just right, not too hot, not too cold, for liquid water to exist on the surface. It's the kind of place where, given the right circumstances, life as we know it could flourish. The surface temperature of Gliese 12b is estimated to be about 107 degrees Fahrenheit, warmer than the average temperature on Earth, but still within a range where water would stay liquid, neither freezing nor boiling away. It's a tantalizing hint at the possibility of life-friendly conditions. But before you start imagining beach vacations on Gliese 12b, there are a few things to consider. This exoplanet is much closer to its star than Earth is to the Sun, orbiting at only 7% of the Earth-Sun distance. That's a close shave by any standard. And it also means that a year on Gliese 12b lasts just 12.8 days. The star that Gliese 12b orbits is a red dwarf, considerably smaller and cooler than our sun. Despite the close proximity of Gliese 12b to its star, it receives only 1.6 times more energy than Earth gets from the sun. So while Gliese 12b might share a few similarities with our home planet, it's far from being Earth's twin. Its unique conditions from its scorching temperatures to its close proximity to its star make it a fascinating subject of study. It's a sobering reminder of the extreme diversity of planetary conditions out there in the universe. But it's also a tantalizing glimpse into the possibilities that await us as we continue to explore the cosmos. While Gliese 12b might not be Earth's twin, it certainly gives us food for thought about the diversity of planetary conditions. Imagine a world where one side is in eternal daylight and the other in perpetual night. Welcome to Speculus 3b. This rocky, Earth-sized planet is a testament to the diversity and extremity of conditions we can find in our vast universe. Its size and composition may mirror our home, yet its environment is far from welcoming. Speculus 3b orbits tightly around its red dwarf star, a dance so close that it completes a full circle every 17 hours. This proximity exposes the planet to levels of radiation that would make even the most hardened extremophile quiver. The radiation is so intense, in fact, that it's likely blasted away any semblance of an atmosphere that may have once clung to the planet's surface. What we're left with is a barren, rocky world, devoid of the life-giving air and protection we're accustomed to here on Earth. 
It's a stark reminder of the harsh realities that many celestial bodies face, even those that share physical similarities with our own world. This extreme exposure to its star isn't the only unique trait of Speculus 3b. The planet is tidally locked, a term that describes when one side of a planet always faces its star, resulting in a perpetual day on one side and an everlasting night on the other. On the daylight side, temperatures skyrocket, while the night side is plunged into a chilling eternal darkness. This creates a world of stark contrast, a planet split into two distinct halves of harsh light and deep shadow. It's a phenomenon hard to imagine when we're used to the reliable rise and set of our own sun, but it's a reality for Speculus 3b. So, as we continue our exploration of the universe and the countless planets it holds, let's remember Speculus 3b, a stark reminder that not all Earth-like planets offer a hospitable home. Our journey through the cosmos has taken us to some truly fascinating alien worlds. Let's take a moment to reflect on the celestial bodies we've encountered on our journey. First, there was HD 26965b, the so-called Vulcan planet. A curious example of life imitating art, this planet orbits the star 40 Eridani A, the very same star that plays host to Spock's home planet in the Star Trek universe. However, the true existence of this planet is shrouded in mystery. Could it be that what we thought was a planet is merely an illusion created by eruptions on the star's surface? Only time and further research will reveal the truth. Next, we ventured to Gliese 12b, an exoplanet just 40 light years away that could potentially support human life. Despite being about the size of Venus and residing in the Goldilocks zone of its host star, this planet is far from being a mirror image of Earth. With a scorching surface temperature of 107 degrees Fahrenheit and an orbit that is completed in just under 13 days, Gliese 12b is a world of extremes. Yet despite receiving 1.6 times more energy from its host star than Earth does from the Sun, this energy is insufficient to guarantee habitability due to the star's lower surface temperature. Finally, we glimpse the barren world of Speculus 3b. Despite being Earth-sized, this rocky planet is far from habitable. Its close proximity to its red dwarf star exposes it to such intense radiation that any atmosphere it may have once had has likely been obliterated. Interestingly, this planet is tidally locked, creating a stark contrast between its scorching day side and its eternally dark night side. These alien planets, each unique in their own way, are but a fraction of the celestial bodies that populate our vast universe. They raise countless questions about the cosmos, the nature of habitability, and the potential for life beyond Earth. As we gaze out into the cosmos, we can only wonder what other alien worlds await discovery and what stories they have to tell. Have to.